right now we're heading over to the Woodlands to pick up my packet for the race where I'm gonna be pacing the six hour marathon. A little worried about it. It's gonna be a little warm. Like right now it's 75 degrees. That's probably really bad temperatures for a marathon, but I should be taking it easy, right? It should be easy for me. Hopefully it's easy for me. Pray for me guys. All right, made it here to the uh, packet pickup area and uh, we'll see what we get. See how big this expo. I remember the expo a few years back being, you know, not huge, but pretty, pretty good size. So we'll see what it is today. All right, since we are pacers, we get to pick our bibs up at the pace group area. Perfect. Oh, oh no, yeah. There you go. Uh, yeah. Hey, um. So this is gonna be the dowel we have to hold yep. for the race. And then this is the pacer bib. All right, made it here to the expo. There's some, you know, cool, cool little stores. Uh, this is Fleet Feet or something. But we'll check out what else they have. It looks like it's a pretty big expo from what I could see. Let's do a taste testing of this lean body. I think protein all the time. This is banana, never had banana. Zero sugar. Oh, zero sugar. It's tasty. It tastes like, yeah, it tastes like those bluebell kind of popcorn. I'm Marcelo Langoni with the city of McAllen. We have our McAllen Marathon. It starts January 13th through the 15th. We have a 5K, a 10K. We got a half, we got a full, we got a relay. It's a flat course, it is a Boston qualifier. Uh, these are last year's medals, as you can see, big, beautiful. And next year is our 10 year anniversary, and so we're planning to go bigger and better. So we are a great city, we're great in hospitality. Come check us out and uh, you won't be disappointed. This is alcohol free. Yeah, alcohol free. So basically, I think, if I drink this, it's, I good. Think it's, .0 it's good for my hydration. That's gonna be the expo. Now we're gonna head home. We're actually at my cousin's place, Agnes. So that's what we're gonna do. Head over to Agnes's place and probably eat. And I'll show you what all I got in the expo bag. What is going on guys? So made it here to my cousin's house. We're staying here. She lives on the north side of Houston. So just a lot easier for us to stay here. And then we're just like, you know, a 10 minute drive up north. But I'm gonna show you what I got from the packet pickup. And this is it right here. This is the bag. First off, we have this. Ooh, I I uh, crumpled up my, my bib. This is my bib right here. 11.57. Got the Goku Runner badging right there. So that is ready to go. I guess you get a bag drop off, some beer, some food, and I got got my shirt. Oh, I also got this. This is my pacer my pacer bib. So I guess got to wear that on the back or somewhere. So uh, yeah, pacing the six hour. I'll tell you about the weather in a little bit. It's not looking good. Uh, they also gave us pacing bracelets. So this is the pacing bracelets, but we should go. So basically a 1344 pace I have to keep for the whole way to make my six hour time limit. I think it's doable. They give us a hat. So that they give us the option of a visor or a hat, and this is a Boko hat. So let's see how that looks. Hmm. Pretty good. Maybe I'll wear that tomorrow. I didn't give us a Pacer shirt, but I did bring my Pacer shirt from home that I ran a few years back. I wanna say like 2015. I probably paced this for a long time ago. I paced it, I think I paced the 530. So got that, got some Band-Aids. You know where you put these band-aids? On your nips, so you don't chafe. Uh, they get a beer mug over here, so got a beer mug, got some goo. McAllen also gave us uh, a race bib, so maybe I'll wear this tomorrow. And we got this, this is like cozy gingerbread granola bar. So a bottle opener from Heineken. Heineken was there giving out 0.0, .0 alcohol-free beer. 
and some other pamphlets. So yeah, that's basically what I got at the packet picked up. I got my packet. Uh, just going to just chill out tonight, not do too much. My cousin is cooking some food for us, I think. And that's gonna be it for today. Tomorrow it's gonna be pretty warm. I think the temperature, let's look at the temperature one last time just to make me a little bit more nervous. 25% chance of rain at night, so they might be raining on us. And let's see, what does it say? So the forecast is for a low of 67 and a high of 79. So uh, yeah, pray for me, pray for me, because I think I can do the, the, the pace regardless, but man, those temperatures are not good marathon weather. I wish it was a heck of a lot colder. That's, it's gonna be tough, but we'll have fun regardless over there. If you guys do see me, say hi. I'll be at the back of the pack, six hours and hopefully you won't see me drop off of that. So hope you guys enjoyed this content today. Tomorrow is the Woodlands Marathon. Hoping to do my pace, six hour pace, 1344. Let's go tomorrow, let's go. See you guys next time. Peace.